so if you take a look at the next design here which is uh, something like services and it's it's very easy so let's start making this section first of all uh, take a group you can always start with a group and then you can take column here inside the group you can take three column and also uh, currently the group width is not defined so I'd like to select the group from here also if you can close the other unnecessary things that I'm not going to use at this moment I'm going to close all of them and select group here and change the content width to 1000 pixel and it's now selected you can add padding and also I will do this uh, later now I'm going to add something so before I add something here I would like to change the browser uh, just zoom out the browser so that it open up some space for me now let's click over here and click on paragraph paste the text that I have copied from here and copy this text also so if you take a look closely here you can see I'm using here Sorcery Pro and the font size is 28 pixel and the semi bold Let's take a look at here and Make it heading so I'm going to make it heading change it to h4 and Change the font size from here to 28 pixel and also change the appearance to semi bold well and click over here again then press enter and paste the code i'm going to use shortcut command v here and then hit enter and type here read more because if you take a look at here there is a link called read more so you can always make it link by selecting the text here and then click on this link icon and you can add or paste your link i'm going to use hash at this moment and click over here now it's linkable so if you take a look closely there is some huge space at this moment uh, but there is less space right so let's change the spacing here and also change the color i'm going to select color first i would like to change the text color to our theme color and then uh, for a spacing I'd like to click over here again and if I go to dimensions click on the plus icon you can take a look at margin and select here and then press 0 from your keyboard and click outside the box here you can see I just reduce the margin now it's time to add image here so you can simply click on this plus icon and drag the image and drop it here at the top of the title and click on media library because we have already uploaded our image here and take a look which one I would like to use this one so I just click over here and click select it so now the image looks perfect and um, let's copy this column and paste it to the other column here so there is a one trick that you can simply do it just click list view scroll down and here you can see it's selected right we can simply duplicate and delete the other one from here again select and duplicate and delete the last one because it's not necessary because we have already copied our text well now let's change the content from here to beauty and then message and also change the icon replace select and change the icon the last one click on replace and open media library then select this one and select here and now as you can see it looks uh, perfect now if I click on update and visit the page and then reload the page here so as you can see uh, it looks perfect now and I can just resize my browser to show you how it looks when I when I'm using full weight in my computer screen 
now i can add some spacing at the top and bottom so by default if i take a look at here there is some spacing at the top and it's similar to here and I'm, i'd like to add some space at the bottom so when i select group here at the right side you can see some options you're already familiar with this i think and if i select this one the bottom part is highlighted here and then add some uh, padding let's add 40 pixel so i am using padding randomly here exactly it's not randomly but uh, if you take a look uh, here the 40 pixel is perfect to the above uh, 70 pixel where i have used 70 pixel uh, why this happens so if you inspect here to understand there is some default padding that are coming from the paragraph tag right so if you take a look closely here you can see the padding is coming from the read more tag and also there is some spacing uh, coming from the other column area so that's why when i add only 40 pixel which is enough to add some padding bottom or spacing at the bottom area and it covers the whole spacing uh, similar to make it similar like the above spacing here so have you understand how it works and hopefully it's completely responsive so you don't have to worry about the responsive here it automatically uh, make your site fully responsive so it looks perfect now and that's all for today and i'll be creating the next part on the next uh, I'll be creating the next section on next part. Thanks.